Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here? From what we have here, this follows when we have a raised to power n minus n. This same thing as a raised to power n over a raised to power n. That is, here we have 4 raised to power x over 4 squared. Then equals to 60 from here. That is, yeah, the same thing as 4 is to power x over 4 square 4 times 4, that's 16. Equals to, yeah, we can write this as 60 over 1. The next step here, we cross multiply. 4 is to power x times 1, same thing as 4 is to power x. Then equals to, yeah, we have 60 times 16. The next step here, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 4 is to power x equals to log 60 times 16 here. The next step here, we apply the power law of logarithm. When we have log m raised to power p, this same thing as p log m. That is, yeah, this becomes x log 4 equals to log 60 and 16 here. The next step here, we divide both sides by log 4. That is, divide this side by log 4. Also, divide this side by log 4. That is, here we have log 4 cancel each other here. x now equals to log 60 and 16 over log 4. The next step here. This follows the law of logarithm. When we have log a times b, this is the same thing as log a plus log b. That is, what we have here becomes x equals to log 60 plus log 16 over log 4. That is, Next step here, we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to log 16 over log 4 plus log 16 over log 4. Then here, we can write 16 as 4 times 4, that's 4 squared. All we have here becomes x equals to log 60 over log 4 plus log 4 squared over log 4. Then here, yeah, applying the power law, 2 comes here and we have x equals to log 60 over log 4 plus 2 log 4 over log 4 which implies here log 4 cancel each other we have two left here that is we have x equals to log 60 over log 4 plus 2 then also here 60 can be written as 4 times 15 then what we have here becomes x equals to log 4 times 15 over log 4 plus 2. And this also follows the law of log room. And we have x equals to log 4 plus log 15 over log 4 plus 2. That is here. We separate this into two fractions. We have x equals to log 4 over log 4 plus log 15 over log 4 plus 2. Then here also log 4 cancel each other. We have 1, which implies x equals to 1 plus 2 then plus log 15 over log 4. 
that is yeah this becomes x equals to 1 plus 2 that's 3 then plus log 15 can be written as 5 3 times 5 then over log 4 then yeah this also follows the law of logarithm and we have x equals to 3 plus log 3 plus log 5 over log 4 that is we separate this into two fractions and we have x equals to 3 plus log 3 over log 4 plus log 5 over log 4 then yeah we can express 4 as 2 times 2 that's 2 squared what we have becomes x equals to 3 plus log 3 over log 2 squared plus log 5 over log 2 squared and here we apply the power of logarithm. 2 comes here and also here. And we have x equals to 3 plus log 3 over 2 log 2 plus log 5 over 2 log 2. And here, from change of this, when we have log a over log b, this same thing as log a to base b that is when we write this we have x equals to 3 plus 1 over 2 log 3 base 2 plus also 1 over 2 log 5 base 2 then here yeah, we bring this together as one fraction this 3 over 1 and we have x equals to the same here that's 2. This becomes 6 then plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2. That is the value of x here we have. 6 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2. Then let's check here. If this satisfies this given problem, that is, we substitute the value of x here. Which is x equals to 6 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2. Then what we have here becomes 4 raised to power 6 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2 then minus 2 here is it equals to 60 on this side then from here we bring this power together as one this 2 over 1 I write it as 4 is to power SM up here that's 2 and here we have 6 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 then minus 4 here is it equals to 60 on this side at this here 6 minus 4 that's 2 we have 4 raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2 is it equals to 60 on this side then here or can be written as 2 square, which is raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2. Is this equals to 60 from here? Then here, this power multiplies 2 cancel each other here. We have 2 raised to power 2 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 is this equals to 60 on this side and here we apply the law of indices and this becomes 2 squared times 2 raised to power log 3 base 2 times 2 raised to power log 5 base 2 is this equals to 60 
on this side and two square here that's four then times this follows when we have a raised to power log b to base a which is equals to b but this here we have three then times here we have five is it equals to 60 from here then four times three twelve twelve times five that's 60 which is equals to 60 from here left hand side equals to the right hand side and therefore we conclude that x equals to 6 plus log 3 base 2 plus log 5 base 2 all over 2 satisfy this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget this step subscribe for more videos turn the description below share this video with thumbs up with your comment see you next class and bye for now